Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Andrea Sylvester and here we are for another Singers React and I'm reacting to Baby Metal monochrome piano version, the first take. So you guys said I should watch this. You know me, I love a good vocal. And so this is Sue Metal and Moa Metal and they are doing the song. I'm super excited to hear this because I think Sue Metal has such an incredible voice. So I'm excited to hear her on this. Um, where they all do it one take. Feel free to check out my music, you know, feel free to do that. Also, feel free to go support me on Patreon. I just launched that. So yeah, we'll get on to with the video right now. The Patreon, you can request some special things if you want me to react to something super obscure and we'll get on with the video. I'm so excited. Wow, not I don't know if you can see this, but I already have tears in my eyes. Maybe I'm an emotional person today or something. Stop! This is so stunningly beautiful. I've also never seen them this up close before. I love I love seeing them in such a vulnerable state right now because well usually they're encouraging like extreme rock behavior at their concerts so it's so it's so interesting to see them in this context where it's just fully stripped down piano and vocal all live vocals i mean obviously all live vocals but all first take clean very clean vocals wow i have always said it sue metal has an incredible voice and this just shows it even more Let's hear some parts. Her voice, her notes are just so clear. She's insanely amazing. Okay, let's go. Ah, perfect notes. I can't. And she even has like, she ends this with like that kind of like emotional like, ah. Sounds like she's all broken up about everything. Okay, while we're having this piano little interlude, she's so good. How old is she, guys? Remind me. But her voice is just has so much power, but she's also, it's very, like, vulnerable, I feel, especially in this piano version. It's delivering so much emotion, but I feel such, like, a vulnerability. There's such a vulnerability to her voice in this track that i've not heard before because usually we see her being like a complete badass singing like these insane rock songs but this different environment really is able to showcase how amazing of a vocalist she is but also able to it also allows her to kind of more so emotionally connect with the song i mean i i'm assuming they do have ballads or something like a little bit more emotional but the th what based off what i've seen is more like rock heavy songs so it's really lovely to see her kind of in a different in her in a different element and in a different realm she's so good oh my gosh they're all i love their outfits and their concept i love how they can't they're not they're not going to stray from that baby metal aesthetic it's still here oh who are these people okay Wow, 
she's amazing. Also, th- we're building the track up a little more. We're ha- adding that um, the strings and the piano part is has a little bit more mu- movement, which is kind of just building in kind of the intensity and the anticipation. And um, it's interesting how we have like the English included in the song as well. But um, yeah, she's amazing. Okay. <laughs> You can also see it in her face, how, and her hand gestures, just how much she's singing with her whole soul and her whole heart. Because you, you can see, like, there's like an intensity in her grip right now and an intensity in her face. And it just shows you that this is a very genuine performance, that she's really connecting with the lyrics. And you can always. I feel in these performances, I saw the Lisa one before this and I felt the exact same thing, but I feel what's so important about vocalists is that you, I want to believe what you're singing. And that's such an important part of the whole performance element is you want to connect with the song and you want people to understand and like feel that emotion behind what you're singing. And I think that's the most important part of just being a vocalist. Like obviously tone technique, that's all important, but I feel if you're if your if your performance feels very um, autopilot and just too perfect, I just personally I have a there's just that it causes a disconnect and I just can't really get into the performance as much. That's just me personally, but with this you can definitely tell from every element. First off, her voice just delivers that sheer emotion. You can see it in her face. You can see it in her hand gestures. Just the way that she's presenting herself, you can tell that this is genuine and very raw and the song means something to her and i love that and that's just what i love to see so let's continue wow she also is she has such like that note was she held for a little bit that was a really deep that was that was like her lower register and i honestly haven't heard that much of her lower register i believe but i really loved like the depth of that note and the depth of her tone in that moment as well um yeah we're back to like you know dynamics and songs guys we're more back to that initial pian just her and the piano and i want i'm curious to see where it ends up i'm assuming that they're gonna build this up and like there's gonna be a bigger moment at the end but um yeah let's continue <laughs> dynamics guys there's that use of dynamics again she kind of got louder and it gives this like swell feeling and if you listen to it it's very pronounced but i mean that's also all intentional intentional dynamics kind of build intensity tension provide more depth and movement to the song but we'll continue
feel she's such a consistent singer is what I'm realizing because she's had like these similar sections of the song and it sounds like they copied and pasted multiple times. Obviously, they did not, but that just shows how how clean and precise she is as a vocalist and I have so much respect for her. I feel like she always delivers her utmost perfection, best vo- vocal performances and I'm honestly shocked. Like, she's so good. How much vocal... I'm assuming they have, like, reverb and there's effects on this. But, I mean, they're not pitch correcting. Like, she is dead on this whole time. And she's singing, like, some hard... Like, this is a hard song to sing. Especially the level of intensity, the level of breath support. And she's doing it. And it looks pretty casually easy for her. I... um yeah she's incredible i honestly commend her so much she's every time i hear her sing i think she's so incredible her tone is just she's like this rocker tone mixed with kind of like a clean female vocal i don't know but it's just really interesting and unique but yeah Also, who are these people, the background singers? I don't know if they're going to be revealed or anything, but um, I was confused at first when I heard up their vocals because I thought it was all live, but our first take, but I got confused. But please let me know who these people are. Is this supposed to be like the Baby Metal 3 members or? Okay. Wow, even her stance at the end. She has so much confidence, I feel, as a vocalist because you can tell she's not backing down from any section of the song. She's not hesitating. She's not scared. Because I feel when one of the worst things is if you're a singer and you're not confident in your vocal ability, it causes you to be flat. It causes you to not go for these big moments. Like you might, instead of belting the big part at the end or like belting in general, you might kind of... um instead replace that with like a falsetto part which is not a bad thing i'm just saying i feel with her you can tell she's very confident in her ability and her vocals so you can tell that she knows that she's gonna hit these notes every time and she literally does she's wild um i like her tone a lot i think she has everything that a female vocalist could want she has a really good tone she has um a lot of versatility we can see with this like she's literally the main main vocalist for a rock band but she's also really talented she can sing these really beautiful ballads because she has that really um extensive technical knowledge of just vocal ability in general and i love it being transferred to this context because while i love a good baby metal rock song it's also lovely to see her sing just more stripped down where you can just hear her with the piano or her with a very simplistic um, track in the back she has the tone she has incredible range and i love that we got to see those lower notes in this performance as well 